And here we are down at the garage, and today we're gonna check out a Toyota Prius and see what we think. And then we're gonna compare it to something else. So here's the Prius, this is what it looks like. You know, the lights always get foggy, whatever else. And we'd open the door and take a look and see what we see. And we don't see nothing. There ain't no dash on this thing. Oh wait, there it is, there's something up there. Uh, it's kind of goofy over here with this little, I mean, Japan made Nintendo, so I mean, what do you want, you know? So, so we can find out what we're doing here. I think it started. Reading on, on Twitter. Yep, it started. And if you want to go into reverse, you got to goof around with this thing and put it in reverse. Oh, it doesn't want to go into reverse. And to put it in park, you got to push a button over here and goof around over here. And uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Well, let's take a look at something else. I'm really not too satisfied with this. I mean, bumper's a little, you know, it's a Prius. I mean, what do you want? So let's go look at this. Now here we have a Chevy truck, you know. It's a lot older and vintage. It's a lot older. And uh, we're gonna check this out and see. See what we have here. And uh, we got like a nice normal dash. There's no nothing, no goofiness in the way. We have a key. Key goes in. Turn it. Turn it again. Truck starts up. Looks pretty good. Radios are simple, easy to use. Goes in drive. That looks pretty good. And uh, the other thing too, if you notice, the truck is sitting outside and the Prius is inside. So do you have any words, sir? I don't think he does. 